Hey guys, it's Miss Baller Pockets here, and I'm finally editing this video. I got this doll July, and it's now October 2nd that I'm editing this video. And this is the Blythe My Melody doll. So this is a perfect time to use my My Melody scissors. So this is like a POV. They are opening my Holy Grail doll. <laughs> And this is the soft, cuddly me doll. And you can see there's the cutout that you can put on the skin. And I am gonna reveal her. Oh, oh my gosh, she is so lovely. I could not believe I got her. It, uh, her prices just keeps on going up. So I think I got a good deal out of this doll from Mandarake. Mandarake. Um, website and this is the artwork of the box I am not gonna throw this away I am gonna keep it probably hopefully I can display it but it is amazing look at that soft cuddly you and me doll sorry it's such a long title so that's why I keep on forgetting but I call her my melody doll she has been in this box for a long long time look at that hopefully she's still okay but spoiler alert, she was okay. Uh, there's a lot of cute details on this doll. A lot of work I have went to this doll. So I think this doll is so worth it. I cannot believe I have it in my hands right now. And I just started collecting April this year. So for me getting my holy grail doll is this early. It's amazing. Okay, there's a lot of tape in here. So I'm just going to probably going to skip away or fast forward this video she is so lovely look at her little dress so about this doll she is a translucent I can't talk translucent doll which is one of my favorite so she is definitely a must for me and she has a couple of special items. Amazing and professional, but she was released September of 2015, and her release price was 26,500 yen. I think that's the most expensive doll. I mean, life doll. Um, she has a RBL face type. Here is pink. The skin tone, as I said, is translucent cream. Um, she has a lot of special items. Um, light purple front facing, light blue front facing, um, light brown right facing, and light gray left facing. So the light purple eye chip is so pretty. I can show you in a little bit. She's finally released in her box. And so as you can see, she has the markings of where she, when she was made and by who and that's how you can tell that she is an authentic blight doll and so she has a lot of covering in her face actually like Arella I don't remember her having a lot of protection for her face but then again she's an old version and made from a different company so maybe that's why but I didn't mind that because that is kind of a good thing that she is solely protected from anything from staining and stuff like that because she has been in this box for a long time since 2015 so almost 10 years she is so gorgeous cute and pretty I don't know I wanted to do this just like a quiet unboxing at this point to admire her so let's do that